The United Kingdom's Royal Navy has taken a bold step forward in maritime defense with the deployment of the SG-1 Fathom underwater gliders, a cutting-edge innovation designed to counter the growing threat of Russian submarine activity in British and NATO waters. Unveiled in a May 13, 2025 report by The Times, these autonomous, AI-powered gliders, equipped with the Lura system developed by German defense firm Helsing, represent a transformative milestone in the UK's maritime strategy. Originally engineered by Blue Ocean Marine Tech Systems for environmental monitoring, such as tracking whales, these gliders have been repurposed into a silent, intelligent shield beneath the waves safeguarding critical undersea infrastructure like pipelines and communication cables. As Russian naval movements intensify in the wake of the Ukraine invasion, particularly around strategic choke points like the Jeyuk Gap and the Baltic Sea, the SG-1 Fathom underscores the UK's commitment to leveraging advanced technology to maintain maritime dominance. Compact and stealthy, the SG-1 Fathom gliders are propellerless vehicles, measuring approximately 1.95 meters in length and weighing around 60 kilograms. Capable of gliding silently at speeds of 1 to 2 knots for up to 3 months, they are designed for discrete, long-endurance missions. The integration of Helsing's Lura AI system, a large acoustic model akin to a language model for sound, enables these gliders to detect and classify the acoustic signatures of enemy vessels with unprecedented precision. Lura can identify sounds 10 times quieter than other AI models and processes data up to 40 times faster than human operators, distinguishing specific ships or submarines within the same class. This capability, built on decades of Royal Navy acoustic intelligence, allows the gliders to operate as an ultra-quiet network, performing passive listening with integrated acoustic sensors and through-water communication systems. When a threat is detected, the gliders surface to transmit real-time alerts via SATCOM, supporting autonomous positioning and swarm coordination across vast maritime zones. The SG-1 Fathom's ability to function as an underwater constellation of sensors marks a paradigm shift in naval warfare. Hundreds of these gliders can be deployed and monitored by a single operator, forming a distributed network that enhances maritime situational awareness at roughly 10% of the cost of traditional crewed anti-submarine warfare patrols. This scalability and cost-effectiveness are critical for a Royal Navy grappling with budget constraints and a shrinking surface fleet, currently at a historic low of 16 major surface combatants. By acting as persistent, undetectable sentinels, the gliders free up manned assets like frigates and submarines for response operations, multiplying force effectiveness. Their deployment reflects growing anxiety within the UK's defense establishment over subsea threats, particularly following incidents like the 2022 Nord Stream pipeline sabotage and increased Russian naval activity in the Channel and Baltic Sea. The gliders are strategically positioned to monitor critical areas such as the North Sea, Baltic Sea, and Atlantic Ocean, protecting vital infrastructure and deterring covert underwater intrusions. The SG-1 program emerged from a Royal Navy contract tasking Helsing with exploring AI for acoustic sensing, a response to the need for innovative solutions in undersea warfare. Unlike the US Navy's Orca XLUUV, which emphasizes strike capabilities, the SG-1 Fathom prioritizes intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, offering a compact, passive, and stealthy alternative for wide area coverage. This complementary role enhances NATO's collective defense, with the gliders already drawing interest from AUKUS partners. Demonstrated at HM Naval Base Portsmouth in May 2025 to Vice Admiral Andrew Burns and industry partners like Ocean Infinity and Kinetti Q, the system is in operational trials with plans for full integration into the Royal Navy's network. The modular, dual-use design, rooted in environmental technology, ensures affordability and scalability, though exact budgetary details remain undisclosed. If trials prove successful, the SG-1 Fathom could be exported to other NATO navies facing similar subaquatic challenges, strengthening alliance-wide maritime security.
the strategic importance of the SG-1 Fathom extends beyond its technical capabilities, reflecting a broader shift in naval doctrine toward data-driven, distributed systems. The glider's ability to operate in swarms allows for dynamic coverage of vast maritime regions, adapting to threats in real time. This is particularly crucial in the North Atlantic, where Russia's modernized submarine fleet, including the stealthy Yasin class, poses a sophisticated challenge. The glider's passive sensing reduces the risk of detection, unlike active sonar systems that can reveal the presence of friendly forces. Moreover, their low power consumption and ability to harvest energy from ocean currents enhance their endurance, making them ideal for prolonged missions in contested waters. The collaboration between Helsing, Blue Ocean, Ocean Infinity, and Chinetic Q also highlights the growing role of public-private partnerships in defense innovation, blending commercial technology with military needs to accelerate development and deployment. Despite its promise, the SG-1 Fathom faces hurdles. The system is still in the testing phase, and its real-world performance against advanced Russian submarines remains unproven. Ethical concerns surrounding AI in defense, particularly in Germany and Nordic countries, may complicate public and political support. The glider's will, small size and buoyancy-based propulsion may limit their effectiveness in extreme deep-sea environments compared to larger platforms. Additionally, integrating their data into NATO's command and control systems requires robust cybersecurity to prevent exploitation. Nevertheless, their strategic value lies in their ability to provide persistent, low-cost surveillance, reshaping how NATO monitors and secures maritime domains. As tensions escalate in the North Atlantic and Russia intensifies its naval posturing, the SG-1 Fathom gliders offer a proactive, intelligent barrier against covert threats. By merging environmental sensor design with military-grade AI, the Royal Navy has illuminated the silent depths, reinforcing deterrence in an era where underwater stealth defines both the threat and the defense.